Actually, there's a number of baseball-related items, it sounds like, Mike. Yeah, it's a little bit complicated, but necessary to go forward. Twins head of baseball, Derek Falvey, met the media today. The updates were on the complexities of spring training, Miguel Sano's status, and oh yeah, without giving names, the Twins, too, have been affected by COVID-19. Derek Falvey did not mention names, but the Twins joined the club of organizations with players testing positive for COVID-19. He said there are only a few, and they're now in quarantine. Uh, we have had some players uh, in the last few days. We've been made aware of some positive COVID tests. Neither of those, they were not at either Fort Myers uh, or, or in Minnesota here. They were players who were um, at, at their home locations. So, uh, and in each case, um, right now are, are doing well. They got an update on Miguel Sano, who will not be charged in conjunction with kidnapping accusations in the Dominican Republic. All charges and uh, any uh, complaints uh, legally or against Miguel Sano were dismissed this morning. As for the next step, spring training with a twist at Target Field this time. 60 players, probably no games against other teams, and a premium on safety. The days will be in a way where we have schedule, very clear schedules as to when players arrive, get their testing, um, make sure that they are uh, handled, the intake is handled a certain way, uh, and then activities around the field. In addition to that, we'll have um, you know, subsets of coaches that are only working with individual groups of players. What he does know in hearing from his players and paying attention to social media is that these guys understand it will be different, but they still want to play their game. You know, our guys want to get back on the field, and Major League Baseball, the players, Players Association, and everybody in the in the group wants to see if we can we can find a way to get there.